going on YouTube. Uh, if you watched my last video just a day, t day or two ago, uh, I made my new swirl filter with the bio balls. And to tell you the truth, I really did not like that concept. I was kind of doubting it when I was uh, building it and shooting it. And when I edited it, I just really got mad. I didn't like the design at all. It was stupid. I didn't think it would work or anything. So I gave it a day, checked it out. Still doing the exact same and I didn't like it. So I ditched that. And so I redid it the very next day. And instead of the long pipe going down into the filter with the T and then the 245s at the bottom, I popped that towards the top so it actually could move around the uh, bio balls. And this is what that one looked like. All right, this is uh, the second version. I've got uh, the drain there, raise this thing up, put another two by four underneath it. Uh, put straight pipe straight out instead to the T instead of any dips. And uh, this is what I've got going on right now. My bio balls in there. Everything seems to be good, but I want to get some swirly action going in there where the bio balls actually move around. And so I'm going to abandon this one. Instead of correcting this, this was going to go to the center and have it swirling. But since it's not really swirling, there's not a lot of water coming out. I'm going to redo this and uh, see uh, how that comes out. And since then, I decided, heck with that, and I took off this 45 there, and uh, actually it was a 90, and um, I took that off, I put this 45 design on there, and then ran a street pipe over with a 90. I tried it without that 45, just that pipe coming in like that. I tried it just the 45 with this pipe, but it's angled down. I tried it with two 45s, I tried it with uh, 190, then a 45, I tried it with a 45, then a 90. I tried just about every combination and uh, gave it some time to settle and everything. And this is the one I'm going with. I kind of like this. We've got a little aeration going down there. I'm not exactly sure how important it is to get a little aeration, but I like the way uh, the bio balls will actually swirl around every once in a while, but otherwise just kind of hold tight to the whole surface. And uh, just pretty much prevent a bunch of garbage from getting down that drain right there where it overflows into. So uh, I don't believe this is gonna be my final uh, attempt at a swirl filter. Um, oh, and by the way, uh, with all of these different ways that I put it, 45s, 90s, extensions, higher, lower, you know, all that different stuff, um, I noticed that I wasn't getting as good of a swirling action as I am right now. Even when I had the uh, 90 on there where it was actually, or the 45, where it was actually pushing against the sidewall to make it swirl, this seems to be, ironically, uh, the way it actually swirls the best. So I'm not exactly sure why that is, but uh, it seems to be working pretty decent. So I'm just going to go with this for right now, and uh, until I think of a better idea, that's all I got.